Amen. Bless the name of the Lord. Glory be to God. I'm coming to you today, praise the Lord, from my, uh, Micah the 7th chapter and the 18th verse. It says, Who is a God like unto thee, that pardon iniquity and passeth by a the transgression of the remnant of his heritage. He retained not his anger forever because he delighted in mercy. Who is a God like unto thee that pardoned iniquity? Glory be to God. And you know, I heard the Lord say, hallelujah, I'm a God of second chances. Hallelujah. He's a God of second chances. You know, when you wrong people or you hurt someone or you disappoint someone, you know, they'll write you off. They'll have nothing else to do with you. Praise God. They'll walk by you. They won't even speak to you. Hallelujah. They'll have a heart and heart. Even if you go to them and ask them, amen, to forgive you or, you know, to, um, uh, pardon, amen, whatever crime or wrong you may commit unto them, hallelujah. You know, a nine time out of 10, they're going to say, well, you know, I'm going to forgive you, but I'm not going to forget about it. But I thank you, God, thank and praise God that he let me know that he's a God of second chances. Hallelujah, glory be to God, that no matter what we have done, praise be to God. God said, hallelujah, if we are able to come to him and repent and turn from it, praise God, he is the God of second chances. And then, you know, as I was thinking about that, God was already also showing me is that God give us the opportunity to get it right. Amen. That mistake that we've done, praise God, that sin that we've committed, God give us a chance to get it right. He'll put us in that same position to see what are you going to do this time? Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You failed the first time, but will you pass the test the second time? Time, he'll allow the same scenario to come up, the same opportunity to come up. He'll allow you to be in that same situation. Hallelujah. But what are you going to do with it? Are you going to pass the test? Are you going to fall into that same trap? Hallelujah. Of the enemy. Or are you going to give heed to the same? Hallelujah. Trap of the devil. But God said he's a God. Amen. Of a second chance. So when you see yourself in that familiar situation and you see yourself in that familiar place where you have failed, hallelujah, where you gave in, amen, to the wrong, praise God, where you gave in to the lust of the flesh, praise God, when you gave in to the lust of the eyes, hallelujah, and your desires, when you fail that test, praise God, know that you're going to be put in that same situation again, glory be to God, but God said, I'm a God of second chances, I'm going to allow you to be in that same situation, in that same scenario, in that same place, hallelujah, and I'm going to give you the opportunity to pass that test so you can go on to the next level. Amen. So you can be elevated, hallelujah, in me. So you can see that you have overcame those things. God said, we are overcomers and we more than a conqueror through Jesus Christ. You know, and as I was thinking about this word on today, what come to my mind was, amen, Peter. You know, when Jesus was talking to Peter and he told Peter that he was going to be crucified, that he was leaving, and Peter was saying, you know, I would do this and I would do that and blah, that and blah, that. And Jesus told him, he said, Peter, before the, the rooster crow three times, you will deny me, praise God. You will deny me. Hallelujah. And Peter denied Christ. But you you know, Peter was put in that situation again. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And at this point, amen, he passed the test. Glory be to God. He passed the test. We see in the book of Acts, amen, he passed the test. God had told him, he says, Peter, you are the rock and upon you I shall build my, my church and the gates of hell shall not prevail against. So know that no matter what Amen. You have failed. No matter where you have failed God in your life, no matter what test you didn't pass, know that God is a God of second chances and he's given you and I the opportunity to pass the test. Hallelujah. To be elevated in him and to be all that he's called us to be in these last and evil days. He's a God of second chances and know whatever test you fail, it's going to resurface. It's coming up again. But God has equipped you. Hallelujah. To pass that test. Glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. To pass that test. Go ahead, hallelujah, and pass the test because he's a God of mercy. He's a God of kindness and he is a forgiving God. I love you. May heaven forever smile upon you is my prayer.